Hey everyone, I have had some requests to kind of um, go through the new Christmas kit that I've been working on. It's really fun and it's um, very traditional in the coloring. I'm working on another one right now that's going to be a little more of the fun pastel Christmas, but this one I wanted to keep it just very traditional and warm. So anyway, I will just run through kind of what we've got. We have this red kind of grunged up wallpaper look. And then we've got a cream one. And this is that same one in a lot lighter of a cream. And then we have this, it's a newspaper background and then there's kind of some stamping over the top. And we have that in a few different colors. There's the green. It's a little brighter than it's looking on camera, but that's okay. And this is actually, yeah, that's pretty close. Um, and now we've got some ads, some fun little ads and some images in the background on this one. Let's turn that. We've got that one in brown and a dark, kind of an olive green. Um, this is a green. It's not looking green on the video, but it's a nice olive green as well. Here's some red ticking. And we've got that in a light, light brown. And a nice gold kind of a color. And we have a grunged up version of it. And then we've added some fun little hollies and some script. And we have that in a gold and an olive and in a small print because sometimes you just want it a little smaller and we have this really beautiful wallpaper design kind of thing and then just your neutral script pages to use as backgrounds or whatever um, and these are designed to be printed eight and a half by eleven uh, high resolution I know a lot of People like to turn them sideways and print them sideways so that they can be used lengthwise in the journal and that's easy to do. So then it would just take up this way and it would run this direction instead as a half a page. And then you'd be able to have it more like a fold out page for your journal. All right, and now we have, I printed these on sticker paper. You don't have to, but just a bunch of little extra labels some cute little pictures, some tags, some odds and ends to go ahead and use in the journal. Then we have some, <clears throat> excuse me, some Christmas words. And I do these on sticker paper again, just cause it's easier. Um, some fun little labels with numbers and whatnot. Some few little fussy cuts and some blank labels. And now we have a page of tags, let's see. Let's start down here. And we've got lots of little image tags and some neutrally paper tags. And we've got more little tucks. These are um, rectangle. I can back out. Now you can see the whole thing at once. That's better. Just lots of fun little images. A good variety. And I did a couple of pages of these uh, pockets. And they have little labels that you can either put on it or coordinate with it or put on a tag that goes in it, whatever. And they're just fun and simple. You just cut and glue around the three sides and you'll have a pocket. And there's another page of those. And then I did a three layer tag, a pocket. So you would cut all three out and then this one goes on top of this one and this one goes on the very top so you've got one two three pockets and you just glue or sew them together and they're really cute if you need it a little smaller you can print it a little smaller on your paper that's the cool thing about digitals and then one more sheet of neutral tags big tall ones to go in the big tall pockets and they just have kind of a lace overlay have a little bit of grunging around the edges and just super fun. 
So stay tuned. We'll be doing some fun videos with these. I'm excited to get a Christmas journal put together and and I'm excited for the season. So hope everybody's doing good. Thank you for watching.